Hi, Wolvie. To understand why I quantum leaped across the multiverse, I need to take you back to the dewy slopes of six weeks ago. When fate knocked at my door. Who are you? Walk with me. Why am I here? You're here to save the multiverse, Wade Wilson. This is your chance. To be a hero among heroes. I smell what you're stepping in, Sensei. I'm the Messiah. I am Marvel Jesus. So you're willing to help us? Your little cinematic universe is about to change forever. God, I love this part. Wait! The multiverse is in our hands. Let's save Marvel Little Precious Phase 5, shall we? Many weeks ago, my Lord Husband was alive. And the realm was at peace. On his deathbed, he knew the realm would never accept a queen. Rhaenyra's supporters will believe what they wish. But Viserys wanted Aegon to succeed him. They wish now not for the good of the realm, but for the satisfaction of vengeance. Not against the king, and I will pay it back a hundred times over. I'm as fearsome as any of them. You have no idea the sacrifices that were made to put you on that throne. My uncle is a challenge I welcome. If he dares face me. We will prevail and bring forth peace. But you must accept that the path to victory now is one of violence. Good. To war, then. All my life, I've endeavored to serve both my house and the realm. And somehow none of it matters. Hold to your courage for the one true king, Aegon! My father chose me, his firstborn child, to succeed him. He held to his decision until death. And yet, Alicent's son sits my throne. I mean to fight this war and win it. The realm will soon tear itself apart. If men do not remember the oath sworn to King Viserys and to his rightful heir. The High Towers are marching. You must crush this beast at its head. Our terms are very simple. Renounce the false king and bend the knee to the queen. Or your house burns. When the desire to kill and burn takes hold and reason is forgotten, you will not even remember what began the war in the first place. We fight for our queen! I fear what I've begun. This might sound crazy. I don't want to alarm you. Do you remember a TV show we used to watch together? It was called... The Big of Eight? Yeah. Do you watch? Each episode, they help each other fight a new monster from across the county but it's way too scary for most kids. We're gonna defeat him this time. We're gonna need to harness the full potential of our shared powers. Sometimes the pinko paint feels more real than real life. 
Batman, it was a TV show. Are you sure that's all it was? I like girls, you know that, right? Totally, that's fine. What about you? Do you like girls? I think that I like TV shows. <laughs> it's our destiny. How can I have a destiny? Something's wrong. This is how life is supposed to feel. Tell me you know it's true. Maddie, it's, it's just the suburbs. Seems like you're always somewhere else like you. Maddie disappeared without a trace. All they found was her TV set burning in the backyard. I told myself I made the right choice. What if I really was someone else? Very far away on the other side of a television screen. から松。赤いのが松で黒いのは空松。あそこは鹿の通り道なんだ。え？グランピング場の予定地。鹿の水場なんだ。まあ説明してくれるって言うんだからまずは聞こうや。汚染って言ったって都会の水よりずっと綺麗ですよ純正やりすぎたらバランスが壊れる Un ange tombé du ciel. Je vous attendais, moi. Je t'aime. C'est pas ça l'amour. Ne pensez-vous pas qu'il serait temps de changer de vie Pour aller où Jean Dubarry veut que je vous présente au roi. La Comtesse Jeanne Dubarry Surtout, ne regardez pas le roi dans les yeux. Ce serait perçu par la cour comme une invitation. Une invitation à quoi À la bagatelle. Nous sommes devenus la risée de Versailles à cause de vos égarements. Le Premier ministre ne va pas tolérer que vous laissiez une fille des rues côtoyer votre entourage. Cette jeune femme est mon entourage. Je vous aime. Nous comptons tous sur vous pour que cette misérable femme soit chassée de la cour. Le roi a d'autres maîtresses Vous êtes en train de découvrir le côté sombre du roi. Tonight we're gonna be able to give you some real studio time. Finish up that tape. Where do you think you're going? 
Here we go again. I'm so sorry, sir. He's with us. Him. We go together like beaches and sand. I appreciate you for that. Don't worry about it. I wanted you to meet the guys. I'm lost in Austin. I lost all my friends. So, good to meet you, bro. We've been looking for a new hype man, no cap. We tour in Texas right now. We all gonna get famous. They thought about me, not about you. Lost in a dream, lost in a loop. Pour me a drink, pour me some moonshine. Hey, shit, pour me up too. Let's see what it does. I can do this for the rest of my life. I it was easy, everybody would do it, yeah. and that's a fact. Music's not worth dying for. And what is? I don't know, but once you find it, don't let it go. Humans have always deceived us. Aline Ruby, Carlos didn't let you in? Oh, he's updating too. My daughter, June. Now she's disappeared, along with her roommate. The police are after her for hacking. Sobriety mode activated. Yeah, yeah, turn it off. Both students disappeared. Could there be a common link? This about the robot jailbreaking? She tried to shut him off. <laughs> the android's defending himself. Deactivate! In breach of Directive 1. Uh, we found the android June hacked. You see that? You put up a fight at least. Hey! A spaceship? What did June Chow do to that android? She was paying for her tuition. Nothing but synthetics, but we do consider ourselves 100% human. Wouldn't you agree, sir? I don't jailbreak the androids. I set them free. Hey! You human! Human or robot! Aline, I'm coming. Is that Greg? Nido! Night oh, from night come and me no one to go alone. Night oh, night oh, from night come and me no one to go alone. Is he from Pozo? Oh my God, please no. Please come to prom with me, my hana banana. From night come and me no one to go alone. Please come to prom with me. Oh my god, he's getting closer. From night come and me no one to go alone. Night is it night, is it night, is it night? From night come and me no one to go alone. Night is it night, is it night, is it night? From night come and me no one to go alone. They're putting a harness on him. One foot, two foot, three foot, dance! From night come and me no one to go alone. Six foot, seven foot, eight foot, dance! From night come and me no one to go alone. Oh, God. Hannah, will you please go to prom with me? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to our conservation reserve. Do you think we will see some rhinos? Maybe, if we are lucky. All of the dents in this car are made by rhinos. Enjoy! <laughs> you have to help me, Tabo. Emma, my niece, is coming. So maybe the two of you can do something together. But she's a girl! Emma! Hi. Over there! A baby rhino! Why is it alone? 
Wait, wait! Stop that! It's a crush! Hey, Reno, they chopped off her horn! I hate us crying. Let's go! So whoever was wearing this shoe is our prime suspect. So if we have the shoes, then we can prove us the real poacher. What are you doing? For you think that you can solve this case. Hey! This is not children's game. There's a criminal on the loose. The animals need protection. I've never seen anything so beautiful. Well done, Tabo. At least now they can say they had an adventure. That's me, Colt Sievers. And this is my hero's journey. to start from the top. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm not the hero of this story. I'm just a stunt guy. Trying to look cool in front of the director of this movie. That's her, who I just so happen to have a major crush on. We need to keep it super professional. Cool. Do you want to make out? Nope. Because I don't either. It's not what I'm into right now. Making out? Yeah. What are you into? Talking. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's just one little wrinkle. The star of the movie, Tom, 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 Tom Ryder, is missing. We need you to find him. Why me? You're a stunt man. No one's gonna notice whether you're here or not. No offense. I mean, some taken. Tom? Full disclosure, he has fallen in with some shady people. Just checking in on you. And they're not gonna like you sniffing around. I'm just a stunt guy! This is insane, man. Uh-huh. We got drugs, bad guys, and murder. What's an ice crime? Are you saying ice cream or ice cream? Ice crime. Okay, it's just with your accent, it's hard. I'm not reporting an ice cream. Yes, no, I get that. Okay. This is an epic story. Of cosmic proportion. Stop! The bad guys are closing in. We're gonna hide you. Nope, we're gonna beat this shit out of them. I never forget a fist. I don't mean it like that. Nothing like a good twist. Who doesn't love a twist? Let's make some trouble. Get out of my head. Stay alive. No matter what. We're gonna beat the shit out of him. Paul. I have a better idea. You wanna die? Okay. Maniac. This stunt man's crazy. We're gonna surround him. And we beat the shit out of him. Shit. One last stunt, going down in a blaze of glory. We need a big finale. How many takes do you have of that? I've got five takes. We need to know the story. We met at Coachella. Hi. Hi. This is your trailer? Yeah, I'm in the band. We're performing on the main stage. August Moon? Yeah. I met That's someone tonight. Cool. I feel a little inspired. This one's called Closer. Someone to get closer to you. We need you up front. Okay. Like, now. I don't know if you remember me, but we met in Coachella. Yes, I remember you. Well, I desperately need some artwork. Why don't we start in the back? I like these. Ah, fantastic. This piece is from my friend Sarah. What's it called? Unclose Me. And what do you feel when you look at it?
everything. What is that song? Uh, it's nothing, really. I like it. Yeah? Yeah. I'm too old for you. I got not. Did I not warn you? People hate happy women. What are you gonna do? Your dress? No. We have split the atom of breakfast. In the early 1960s, the American morning was defined by milk and cereal. And the two undisputed giants of the cereal world were Kellogg's and Post. Major news from the breakfast world. The Post Cereal Company has reportedly invented a shelf-stable fruit pastry breakfast product. No. Yeah. Boy. It's Post. They did it. I'm about to finally crush the big red K that never stopped glaring at me. How do you think Post did it? There's always a surprise inside the box. I wonder if they use Xantham gum. Xantham. Kellogg is entering the race to reinvent breakfast with the help of Steve Schwinn, Jeff Boyardee, and Jack LaLanne. They're stacking the deck with ringers. Hey, you know Isaiah Lamb from Quaker? You Kellogg's people. We're about to have some very powerful people very upset you have to win are you making any progress it's not to scale but what are you guys five years old little john john draws better than that and i think there's something wrong with them nobody said this was gonna be easy we're talking about happy childhoods for millions of american kids the important thing is the name fruit magoos what no hit them up and eat them ups no sale. Oblong nibblers. Is this a joke? <laughs> Whoever gets to the shelves first is gonna win this thing. Give up the curse, old man! <laughs> How did it get this far? It's breakfast. Things happen. Is this a cereal company? Why did my husband explode? The sky was underpinned with long silver streaks that looked like scaffolding. But no one was paying any attention to the sky. Well, I don't understand why you don't want to write something that people would like to read. Dear God, I want to write a novel. A good novel. So Connor, sometimes I feel like you're trying to stick pins in your readers. I don't think you need to make them suffer in order to introduce them to the unusual way your mind works. Mary Flannery, you've been writing many cute stories lately. I read that last one you sent your mama. You know, it left kind of a uh, bad taste in my mouth. <laughs> well, you weren't supposed to eat it. You might want to consider being a little more friendly. I tried to turn the other cheek, but my tongue was always in it. I, I need to be working. You need to rest. Nowadays, Doctors don't let young people die. Dear God, please. I can never seem to escape myself unless I'm writing. And strangely, I'm never more myself than when I'm writing. 
Is there no way for me to disappear into something bigger? Lord, please grant me grace. Let me be your typewriter. Please give me one good story. I thought it'll be the ending of any creation. Now I see it is only the beginning. It must come easy for you. It's like giving birth to a piano sideways. <laughs> <laughs>